All right, Scott, Foam Stars, eight minutes of gameplay. It's great to video. Now listen. Hello, what you're about to Eight minutes of Foam Stars. Foam Stars gameplay. We'll be showing two modes here, the team deathmatch-like Smash the Star and the more objective-based mode Rubber Duck Party. Okay. Enjoy. Now I'm going to be honest with you. We're going to be talking you know, most, of, most of the gameplay. But bro, I wish this game, obviously, you know, this game, it got like, like, uh, like trailers and stuff like that. But I wish this game got more of like a push, bro. Because I'm gonna tell you some things that I like so far, like as we're as we're like watching this. I love the combat in this game. Even though you are trying to like cover the map in like in, in like the most like foam and stuff like that, and like the soap and stuff, bro, the combat is really good in this game. Like, bro, look at this, bro. Graphically, it looks nice in my opinion. Obviously, you know. If you ever play like Splatoon, you know the objective is to like you know. By the time that timer ends, uh, you try to get like the like most of the map covered in your color. So if you're pink, you know you try to cover it in pink. If you're blue, you know you get it. But obviously, like you know, it like this game does have a lot of resemblance uh, from Splatoon. So you know it is what it is. I, I'm not really mad at it. That's not the reason why like I was like mad or anything like that. It's just um. I don't know, it was different. Like, I never played a soap game before, so. I even saw some people, um, some people said, like, and this is, like, before the game even came out. Whenever, uh, like, the second trailer came out for this game, a lot of people, you know, were calling, like, they were calling, like, uh, Splatoon ripoffs and all this and all that. Which, you know, it's their opinion. They can say that. It's their opinion and stuff like that. So, you know, it is what it is, but. See, look at that. If you could, like, she basically just bullied the dude spraying the blue. That was crazy. It's nice though, bro. I don't know, bro. I don't know why, bro. But like, I'm, I'm really like addicted to like the color in this game. Here's the thing, though. I don't know if, okay, see, how like she just rolled out. I don't know if, if, if pink and blue is like the only colors in this game. I mean, I imagine that there's more. So obviously, if you guys didn't know, like, you see how, like, she had, like, the little snowboard thing or whatever, like, little, uh, board or whatever? Obviously, she can do that on the pink, because she's on the pink team, but if she goes on the blue, she's gonna, like, uh, like, 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 spaz out and, like, move out the way. Oh, GG's, I think pink won, yeah, pink won. So I think this is Team Deathmatch, this is, this is the Team Deathmatch one, so if all seven characters, um, get... Is it seven? I think it's seven. Or oh, sorry, all four characters. If all four characters get wiped out, then um, like obviously, like you know, the other team won. That's the like team deathmatch part of it. That's what I say. Like I don't like I don't even think that the, that like the um, that the combat like the combat is literally like the is four team deathmatch. But if you're in like a regular game to where they try to like cover everything in the map, then the combat is a plus. But not everybody is, is going to care about the combat. They're going to like cover the map and stuff like that. Crazy. I can't wait to play it though. I haven't played it yet. I have not played it yet, but I'm gonna be honest with you. I cannot wait to play this, bro. This is crazy. Look at this. But I think it's just the color. I think it's the color that, that that's just like Wow, bro. That's beautiful, bro. This is the first time I was ever like starstruck over like a over like a trailer because like you know. I don't know. It's just like the color. I told y'all before, bro. If you want to, you know, if you're like a game developer without whatever, and like I react to your game, and like I like the visuals and the graphics and stuff like that, you already got me. You already got me. There's literally no if, ands, or buts. There's no X, Y, Z. If your graphics got me locked in, bro, it's over. It's, it, you got me. GG's. That has, now that doesn't mean that the gameplay is just a 10 out of 10. But I'm gonna be honest with you, it makes it a lot more easier for me to play if I'm like already just starstruck over the graphics. Bro, the blue team is going crazy. They're up 60. Okay, wait, so this is the blue team versus the purple team. Oh, 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 oh. He got hit with like a snowball or something like that, or a foam ball or something like that. So the spec, so 
if you get so if you die you come back like five seconds later it's kind of like um it's kind of like overwatch or like any like you know uh teams like game besides like call of duty because like i don't like obviously like call of duty doesn't really have a uh they don't really have like a like a like a waiting time whenever like you die you just instantly just come back bro i love that so much bro like how like you can move on like your own color that's fine bro okay oh ooh, hold up. purple's coming through purple whoa 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 purple's coming through so i wonder if there's a way you can like you can like get out of like that ball wait you can be in a bubble i wonder if you can use the bubble as like a shield or something like that This looks heat, bro. This looks fire, bro. This looks fire, bro. I wish they got more of a push. I'm gonna be honest. I wish this definitely got more of a push. Ooh, foamed up. Oh, so wait. So like, why is this player? So why is this player glowing right here? Your team has the ducky. Okay. Because obviously, guys, listen. I, I still gotta learn a lot about this game. Cause like, you know, I haven't played it yet. I gotta learn a lot about it before I know all the information. Trying to see, cause there's so much going on on it. <laughs> Here's what I'll say. Here's what I'll say. Already, I I didn't even have to. Oh snap! But why is it? Okay, already. I'll be honest with you. Even though the game looks really good, it is kind of hard to see what's going on. Especially like whenever like you're facing up against people. That it is kind of hard to see like like you know like who you're shooting at, what you're trying to do. Okay. Yeah, blue team's gonna take this. Oh, they got overtime too. Oh, wait a minute. So I think purple got it. Yeah, purple got it. And then it turns around. Okay. That's fine. I like that a lot. So if, if, if the other team takes it, the the objective turns around. Okay. Bro, I love the start. I'm gonna be honest with you. The start is crazy. Obviously, like, you can get rid of like the other team's color. Okay. I did that. That's fire. That's fire. That's fire. I like that. Okay. So I'm trying to see if um I'm trying to see if the objective because I think that if you um because right now the purple team's in control and the blue team oh 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 my god the purple team what. Oh my god, the purple team just went crazy. Wait, was that it? Oh, that was it, man. That was it, man. Listen, I wish Foam Stars got more of a push. Uh, I mean, obviously, you know, they had like multiple trades and stuff like that, but I just wish that like the game got more of a push, man, because honestly, it looks pretty fire, man. You never know. They might, this might be, I could see this game becoming, I mean, and not in a disrespectful way, but I can see this, I can see they um, make this game free next year and then like a lot of people might like it because at the end of the day you know it if there's a you know a really hot game out and they make it free like for example right fall guys uh the first year fall guys came out was 2020 and i remember i bought it i think i bought it a week after it was 20 dollars on playstation and um i bought it right and then like i forgot what month it was but i think like a few months after or even a year after they made the game free and that's when a lot of people hopped on i think they i think they made the game free that same year um, which is, you know, unfortunate because I paid twenty dollars for it, but I still enjoyed the game because every content creator was playing, and I'm like, whoa, hold up, let me see if I can, you know, play this. So, um, obviously, you know, Fall Guys that that turned out to be a good game. Uh, I think now Fall Guys is still getting, it, I think it's still getting like a little bit of attention now, but it's not as popular, you know, as it used to. But now Foam Stars, I wish that like the company that that you know that that made Foam Stars, I wish that that they um. That they kind of pushed it, especially towards like you know streamers and stuff like that, and uh, they would have more streamers play it, and obviously the more streamers that play it uh, equals the more eyes that's on it, and like obviously you know the more players on the game. So you know if it, if it can you know try to get into like the like the um, how do you say like social media route of it because it's, that's not really a bad idea. Among Us has success in it, Fall Guys has success in it. These type of party games and stuff like that. I'm gonna say this is a party game, but like I mean. It is bright. It, the The whole theme is like dancing and colorful, and 
I, I would suggest this is like a party game in my opinion, but um, if they can really hop on like the content, like the content creator wave, um, then, then it would do good because honestly, a lot of video games has been doing that since what, 2010 when, you know, YouTube was just now taking off uh, back then and stuff like that. And you had like LEA and, and all these people playing Call of Duty. And it, here's what I'll say. Call of Duty was already popular back then, especially in the early, in, uh, early 2010s. But I'll be honest with you. Uh, people like Ali A, people like um, uh, uh, Nade Shot, people like uh, uh, Scump, like the whole phase thing, that was a huge, bro, oh my god, them doing 360, no scopes and stuff like that, that really got me into Call of Duty back then, so at the end of the day, I, I wouldn't be surprised if, you know, if, if it continues, if, if a lot of, you know, gaming companies, a, a lot of gaming developers continue to go the content creator way because they've been doing it for 10 plus years and obviously it works, so. Other than that, comment down below. What do you guys think about Foam Stars? You guys are there for next time I'm out. And.